Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. This is Izharul Lamia and you are welcome to the EDU Kabil. And today lecture, I am going to explain about the carbohydrate. We know that carbohydrate is very important and organic compound definitely very important rules in animal and plant bodies. Carbohydrate contain carbon, hydrogen and oxygen. The ratio of carbon, the ratio of hydrogen and oxygen and carbohydrate is same like in water that is 2 ratio 1 except deoxyribose which are present in the DNA. The general formula of carbohydrate is that C in H2 and whole N. We know that carbohydrate contain two types of functional group, of a functional group that is aldehyde and ketone. The, due to these two functional groups, carbohydrate can undergo different types of reactions. Carbohydrate also classified into three categories. The first one is monosaccharide, the second one is oligosaccharide, and the third one is polysaccharide. The first class of carbohydrate is monosaccharide. Monosaccharide is a very simple sugar, a very simple type of carbohydrate. They cannot hydrolyze into more simple sugar. They are sweetened, soluble in water and they act as a monomeric unit of the polymer of carbohydrate um, it means that polysaccharide or logosaccharide all the hexoses like fructose glucose fructose they are monosaccharide those carbohydrate which contain uh, which contain the aldehyde group these are called hexoses while the while the carbohydrate which contain ketone functional group is known as ketosis and both hexose and, and ketosis are the structure isomer of each the second most important class of carbohydrate is oligosaccharide we know that oligosaccharide is hydrolyzed 1 to 10 monosaccharide unit they are also soluble in water they are also sweetened test but remember here is the important point is that they are soluble in water but it compared to monosaccharide they are less soluble in water that's why here uh, remember it the important point is that we know that um, the solubility occur due to the solubility of carbon is due to the hydroxyl group and we know that um, when monosaccharide uh, react with each other the remove here the removal of water occur uh, and the removal of water occur and as a result the the dimer is palm when two monomer reactor is no the dimer is palm it means the polymer of two monosaccharide unit and this reaction is this reaction is known as condensation reaction you see this reaction in your screen so here in this reaction the removal of water occur and we know that water contain a hydrogen in hydroxyl group this hydrogen in hydroxyl group is removed from the monomer so when they remove the decrease of hydroxyl group is a result the decrease of solubility of water therefore oligosaccharide is less soluble in water and uh, less soluble in water as compared to monosaccharide the third important class of carbohydrate is polysaccharide we know that polysaccharide are sweet and sweetless in some non-soluble in water they are why not soluble in water no, i already explained the reason due to the uh, decrease of hydroxyl group remember that they are very uh, uh, abandoned in nature because cellulose is uh, the very important class of polysaccharide so every green plant contain every green plants and young plant means the stem of young plants and old plants all are contain the cellulose therefore they are very abundant in nature Another important uh, point about the polysaccharide, they are uh, the exoskeleton of arthropod also made from the polysaccharide like chitin. They act as a storage molecule and plant in the form of starch. Why? During photosynthesis, when glucose uh, is prepared in the green leaves, they uh, use this glucose for their source, for their purposes and the excess glucose they store in the form of starch they act as a storage molecules in animals the carbohydrate when the glucose level is increased they are stored in the form of 
so these are about the carbohydrate the food is carbohydrate we discussed here carbohydrate are the organic compound which contain carbon hydrogen and oxygen the, we also discussed carbohydrate classified into three classes this is monosaccharide oligosaccharide and polysaccharide we know that uh, monosaccharide are sweet and taste soluble in water but as compared to oligosaccharide they are sweet and taste than oligosaccharide and more soluble in water we also discuss why the monosaccharides are more soluble than water than oligosaccharide uh, we also discuss this reason that this is due to the hydroxyl group uh, the third class is uh, Phallisaccharide is hydrolyzed more than and give more than thin a monomeric units. They are tasteless and not soluble in water. They play a very important structure and functional role. Uh, the cellulose which is present in the silvala plant cell are important phallisaccharide which is therefore they are most abundant in nature. The chitin which uh, made the arthrospore skeleton they are phallisaccharide. They also use a storage molecule like the uh, starch and glycogen the carbohydrate play important nodes is in the source of energy so if you understand please like just like my video subscribe my channel thank you so much